See, now his feet can't even reach the pedals. But a five-year-old boy is already being called a piano prodigy. CNN's Todd Tongan introduces you to the pint-sized pianist and his proud parents. <laughs> Jacob Velasquez likes to play games and go swimming like any other five-year-old little boy. But when he goes from the pool to his piano, something very special happens. You could call him a mini Mozart or baby Beethoven because Jacob began playing when he was barely four years old. Willie was at work, I was in the kitchen. And I hear um, the song that Willie was playing the night before, and I thought, is Willie's home? And I came here, Jacob? Oh my gosh, that's you? Jacob then learned to read music. Jacob managed to learn Beethoven's sonata in just three weeks. He doesn't even have to look at the music anymore, and that's because he has a photographic memory. So they went ahead and had him audition for the National Musicians Guild. And the audition process is quite daunting, something even veteran musicians would get nervous about. He had to learn uh, 10 classical pieces all by memory, and so he did. And he did great. He did amazing. Actually exceeded the expectations. Crescendo! Jacob's piano teacher says a song that takes her other students a month to learn, he'll master in just one class. But this pint-sized pianist isn't without his own challenges. I think he hasn't in his mind the whole knowledge but he is too short the hands, and he's too small, and he wants to play that he knows, but he cannot do that. So Jacob tinkers with his technique to play certain pieces. And he told me, okay, Mr. Jacqueline, I, I think this is the best, the best finger for me. What do you think? So I'm kind of hard, too. Nice job. <laughs> I found out he's also a wizard on the Wii, but his parents say they don't have to push the piano. Do you like playing the piano? Yes. Why? Because I learn all these songs.